So this is going to be the quick video cliff notes when it comes to the Battle of Landing Eye versus Instapage. Now, in case you're watching this on YouTube, if you look deeper into the description, there will be a link to the blog post which goes much more in depth in details when it comes to the battle of these two landing page builders. So first and foremost, let's take a look at the pricing when it comes to landing eye. There is a very big difference when it comes to the pricing of these two landing page builders. First and foremost, when it comes to the beginning core plan, that's gonna be $39 a month. They also have the option to pay annually, which is going to save you some money, very similar to Instapage, but you get unlimited landing pages, five custom domains, 100,000 visitors per month, month, five account users, support through email, along with 10 active pop-ups, plus all the elementary features and a few more other things, all right? Plus, as you go up, obviously, you increase your perks when it comes to the plans, but you can get a very quick visual when it comes to what Landing Eye has to offer. On the other hand, we have Instapage, which is going to be significantly more, but for good reason, all right? Pretty much, they have two plans. They have the business and the enterprise plan. Business is going to be $199 a month. If you want to save money and do annual pricing, it comes out to $149 a month, given the fact that you just make one payment every year, okay? Enterprise is going to be customizable, so you would have to speak to support when it comes to all the features and the pricings. But going back over here, as you can see, this comes with a lot of things that are going to be geared more towards intermediate and experienced marketers, all right? A lot of what Instapage has to offer is going to help you when it comes to pay-per-click advertising, especially when it comes to a lot of things like post-click score and ad map. As you can see right here, the post-click score measures your ad to experience relevancy. It's the percentage of ads that send traffic to a unique post-click experience. Another thing is ad map, as it shows right here, visualize your ad campaigns and effortlessly connect ads to relevant post-click landing pages all in one place. They have a lot of other great features, which I'm not going to dive too deeply in, but this is a very uh, quick comparison. Like I said, uh, Landing Eye is going to be for a wide variety of marketers. While on the other hand, you have Instapage, as it says right here, deploy unique landing pages for every ad convert more instapage customers get up to 400 percent more from their digital ad spend with the most advanced landing page platform so aside from the pricing you are going to get many more advanced features when it comes to instapage overall so wrapping it up very quickly here are my recommendations when it comes to using each of these landing pages tools so you'll want to use instapage if you don't mind the higher price tag this also goes in align with if you're an intermediate or experienced marketer first and foremost as i talked about before instapage is going to have plenty of great perks and features when it comes to utilizing your landing pages with paid advertising. So this isn't going to be the best fit for probably someone who just started online and wants to make a few landing pages. Also, you're not going to mind the higher price tag if you're investing in pay-per-click advertising should you be making sales already. Lastly, but not least, you'll probably want to use Instapage if you're looking to run any type of paid advertising, especially PPC, which pretty much goes hand in hand with all the other bullet points that I talked about. This is clearly a landing page built that isn't going to be great for newbies, which I talked about previously, uh, and it's based upon a lot of their features. And one more thing that I didn't get to mention, the Instapage drag and drop builder for creating landing pages is a breeze. I absolutely loved it, so it's not going to be all that challenging to figure out, which is always a good thing, okay? Aside from that, you do get 30 landing pages and 30,000 monthly visitors when it comes to utilizing Instapage. Then, on the other hand, we have Landing Eye, okay? You'll want to use Landing Eye if you want the cheapest option. Clearly, as we talked about, about previously, you know, you're looking at around 39 a month compared to either 199 or 149, depending on how you want to, you know, pay for it. That's going to be a very big price difference. Okay, so keep that in mind. You'll want to use Landing Eye if you consider yourself more of a newbie marketer. Like I said, uh, it's hard. It's going to be hard for a newbie to actually use Instapage and get a good ROI out of it, especially if they're not too familiar with marketing. They're not making any sales, or they don't have any type of product offer or service to recommend at the time. Last Last but not least, you'll probably want to use Landing Eye if you like to be able to create an unlimited amount of landing pages. As you can see right here, this is actually a very nice perk, and sometimes you have to pay more for that when it comes to other type of sales funnel builders or landing page builders as well. So if you're looking to create a ton of landing pages and do a lot with them, then Landing Eye will probably be your choice. So like I said, that's the very quick cliff note when it comes to the battle of Landing Eye versus Instapage. I hope that helped you out, and I will put a link down below where you can get started with each. The good news is that both of them come with a free trial, so you can always test them out and make sure that they're going to be perfect for you. All right, that's about it. Thank you for watching and enjoy.